I joined the retreat to spend some time with myself, um, to kind of understand myself a little bit more and just get some awareness of how I was feeling and what was going on with me. So connect with myself. Being in the city, you kind of forget to spend time with yourself, you kind of forget to be with yourself and you're so much caught up in a nine to five routine that you forget there is life outside of that routine and that's something which I was missing a lot. I came to the retreat because I was feeling stressed and busy in my life and it's helped me get some clarity. I enjoyed, obviously, the beautiful, beautiful area. It's stunning here. Uh, it's amazing scenery, looking across the, uh, the Pyrenees uh, and some lovely walks through the, uh, through the valley. The simple fact that you stand in any one corner of this retreat and you can be surrounded by nature, by undisturbed nature, and that is a rare gem, that is a rare find especially for someone whose entire life has been living in a city and you crave for that. Um, some great exercises and sessions with the group. I enjoyed the group, meeting people that you would normally meet with and learning from their experiences because everyone has a different experience to their lives. So it's nice to hear other experiences of life and learn from them and take things from them and be able to show them stuff as well to be able to give them advice too and help them and it's, a, it's like a family you become like a family yeah that's the best thing Step one is noticing. Second, you pause, you check, you realize. Third step, you direct, you have a resolution like, actually, I need to change it. You bring in compassion, you bring in friendliness, you, you draw your mind towards the present, you, you redirect your attention to the breath. You direct your attention to the sensations in the body. The way the entire workshop has been designed, um, all the group sessions, all the individual sessions that has been designed to help you as an individual, even though you are part of the group, is has had a profound effect on me personally, but even for the entire group. And it's it's not something that I have come across before, and I have been to couple of retreats in the past. This is nothing like any other retreat that I've been to. And yeah, I would definitely be wanting to come here again. Remember the quote by the Buddha, he said, happiness is not a destination, it's a journey. So stop projecting it out there, over there in the future or in the past, be here now. Give yourself permission to be content now. I would say to put yourself first and to do something for yourself to change what you're not happy about in your life. Be, do it. <laughs> um, and become very open-minded. Very open-minded and don't be scared. And don't be scared about what comes up and don't be, don't, don't be closed off, don't shit yourself, be open, yeah, don't be scared, just do it. I would say do not miss out on this opportunity, whether or not you are facing any tough situation or a difficult situation, 
take that leap of faith. Just come for the sheer fact that you are surrounded by raw, organic, undisturbed nature. Being in the midst of mountains is something that is not an everyday thing. And yes, if they do want to learn more about who they are, how they can be a better version of themselves, then definitely it's without a doubt the best place to be.